Hey there, friends. How's it going? This is actually a video of me telling you how it's going around here. Uh, this is August 21st, 2023. It was nice to worship with those of you who could make it yesterday, where we got uh, a very determined and faithful um, Canaanite woman. Uh, that was eventually uh, identifying as the beggar that she is at the kneeling in front of her Lord Jesus. And Jesus really pulling that wonderful confession that we can all read and, and reflect on and, and realize that we too are beggars that look for a crumb from our master's table. Uh, that although we do not deserve it, your merciful Lord actually delights in giving that to you. So we can boldly go to him in that way. Uh, that can even set your prayers in place to speak boldly to your Lord, whether it's out loud or not. Um, this week, we move to Pentecost the 13th Sunday after Pentecost, and it's a pretty cool conversation that Jesus has with his disciples on who people think the Son of Man is. Um, and then he directs the question directly to them. Peter responds, and uh, the way he responds, Jesus recognizes as a confession that comes from God himself. And um, the Office of the Keys are involved in that gospel text, too. So we'll see what comes out on Sunday. Um, yesterday was also a, a day I got to show a few pictures that Leah was able to send. Look at that. A few generations of pretty cool folks. Um, so there was a buddy walk put on by the Northwest Iowa Down Syndrome Society yesterday in their board organizes a really nice walk that goes through Arnold's Park, and we got to ride some rides. And uh, yeah, all in all, really, really fun afternoon. That was on waiting to get on the Ferris wheel. Um, there's the Eggdorfs minus Emberly. Emberly was probably going on the roller coaster a lot. I think I saw her go on that quite a bit. Some nutty bars. And that was all after the walking. Bellamy had quite a crew there. And there's the whole group. Good to see so many other folks from this part of the state participate with that as well. Oh, got a couple pictures from last Thursday's SHARE group. SHARE is a group for widows and widowers. Uh, that uh, Deanna helps, Tiedemann from our church helps organize. They meet at our church uh, most often or every time these days, uh, once a month. I think it's the third Thursday. Uh, but yeah, we had some nice singing uh, and a very well attended event there. So yeah, there's a couple things going on for you. We've got uh, another Wednesday night volleyball game just one it's the last of the regular season um, if our saint paul lutheran team wins that one i think we've got an inside track on a one seed going into the tournament so that league will wrap up pretty soon it's once again it's been a fun summer for that uh worship will be at 9 30 a.m hope to see you all there for that a couple dates to point out with in this video. I know it's not a, for a couple and a half weeks away, but we're going to have here in our fellowship hall a potluck, a first Wednesday potluck. Uh, that's something we hope to do this coming year where we take the first Wednesday night and at 630 uh, enjoy some food fellowship and also an educational component or some catechesis we could call it uh, that 
as of right now, the plan is going to be to kind of explain and speak to one another uh, about why we do some things here that we do. So why do we, what are we doing when we stand up and say the Apostles' Creed together during worship? Um, why do we have the stuff around here that we do? Um, why are we organized the way we are? Uh, that first one is going to center around some of the ministries and and things that are going on in this upcoming year now that we have a calendar kind of put together just so everybody knows what is going on, what these groups are doing and and stuff like that. And I think it's going to be a lot of fun to spend a little time with each other on Wednesday nights. First Wednesday for September is September 6th. That would be cool to see you all there. Uh, Rally Sunday is going to be on September 10th. So uh, looking forward to the kickoff of the Sunday school year. And uh, looking at the list of lessons, uh, our kids and are going to get to learn about some really cool things coming out of Scripture. There's a few birthdays to um, lift up here. Jeff DeSteiker has a birthday in a few days. So happy birthday, Jeff. And your last name might be a blind spot. I'll keep working on it, the pronunciation. Eric Van Beek has a birthday on Saturday, and so does Michelle Wellendorf. So happy birthday to you guys. No anniversaries coming up this week. There will be some next. Uh, and then I'll leave you with Psalm 138. It's a responsive psalm that we'll read together on Sunday. Here's verses 4 and 5. May all the kings of the earth praise you, Lord, when they hear what you have decreed. May they sing of the ways of the Lord, for the glory of the Lord is great. Now you know this. The glory of the Lord is great. We can also pray that the kings and leaders in this world will, would also have knowledge of Christ and his king, kingdom. Um, that sets a person up to do their vocations pretty well, even if you're a political leader or whatever job you might have, whatever role you might have in your family, to know that the glory of the Lord is great and something to sing out about, that's a good thing. That's all for now. Adios.